Hi, my name's Trev Hutchings, and this is how to use the Vintage Limiter to boost the volume level of your vocals to the maximum without clipping in BandLab. Here is a vocal track that is too quiet. I came from the emptiness. So let's use the Vintage Limiter to increase the volume to the maximum level while making sure the louder parts of the vocals do not clip. So tap on the Vocal Track Header. And at the bottom of the screen, tap on Effects. Now tap on the plus icon to create a new effects preset. Drag your finger across the tabs at the top of the screen and tap on the Dynamics tab. Then drag your finger up the screen until you can see the Vintage Limiter effect. And then tap on the Vintage Limiter. A limiter is used to fix the maximum volume or loudness of the track and if set up correctly will stop the track clipping. Here we will use the limiter to boost the vocals to the maximum output volume of the track which is called 0 dB. To set the maximum volume to 0 dB the text box to the right of the word volume needs to be set to 0 and since it is already set to 0 we don't need to change it. To boost the loudness of the vocals, we need to move the dot on the line below the word gain to the right. Here we want to boost the loudness as much as possible. So drag the dot on the line below the word gain all the way to the right. And because the volume has been set to 0 dB, any vocals that have been boosted too loud will be automatically reduced back down to 0 dB and so will not clip. Attack sets how quickly the limiter takes to start reducing the loudness of any vocals that are too loud. So to stop any clipping we want the limiter to reduce the loudness as quickly as possible. So drag the dot on the line below the word attack all the way to the left. Release sets how long the limiter takes before it resets. This will depend on your vocals. But here I suggest you drag the dot on the line below the word release all the way to the left. So the limiter resets as quickly as possible. You may need to drag the dot a bit to the right if you hear a tremolo type of effect on the vocals. Knee sets how quickly the limiter reaches maximum reduction. And since we are using the limiter to give us the maximum vocal loudness, we want the limiter to reach maximum reduction of the vocals that are too loud as quickly as possible, to avoid clipping. So drag the dot on the line below the word knee all the way to the right. Enhance adds distortion harmonics but we don't want any for this setup. So we will leave it set to zero. Now tap on the back arrow at the top left of the screen and tap on the X icon at the top right of the screen. For this to work properly, the track volume needs to be set to zero. So tap on the mixer settings icon at the bottom left of the screen. Now drag the dot on the line on the vocal track header to the left until it says zero on the pop-up message. If you can't quite get the dot on exactly zero, drag the dot so it says a minus number. Now if you tap on the S icon to solo the track, and then tap on the play icon 
you should see the green lines on the master output volume meter go all the way across the meter, but stop before they reach the red section of the meter. I came from the emptiness. Finally, tap on the S icon to turn off solo. Then tap on the mixer settings icon. If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.